This is a very special story tonight. Ten years ago this month, Petra Nemkova suffered an immense personal tragedy when she became one of the victims of the Indian Ocean tsunami. She even lost her fiance in that disaster. But since her recovery, she has dedicated herself to turning tragedy into triumph. She went on to create a charity, the Happy Hearts Fund, that helps rebuild communities in areas devastated by natural disaster by building safe, and resilient schools, and what an impact it's had right now, serving nearly 50,000 young students in those areas already affected. So happy to have you here, Petra. It's really a pleasure. What, what wonderful work you do, and, and you suffered such a personal tragedy. Tell me a little bit about that. Well, 10 years ago, almost 10 years ago, on December 26, um, 2004, I was walking uh, on a beach on a, uh, with my partner. It was a beautiful sunny day. Uh, and um, next moment, um, the life of us and lives of millions of people has changed. Um, my partner passed away, as you mentioned, and my pelvis was broken in four places. Um, it was, I never heard the word tsunami, actually, before. That no. was the first time I, um, or I experienced it, obviously, but I heard right. it. And um, it really changed my life um, in many different ways. But also, I've learned a lot. I've learned uh, lots of amazing lessons. You have, and you created this Happy Hearts Fund, which is fabulous. Because now you're, you've gone out and you have built so many schools. And in fact, the, the, the 25th anniversary is coming up right now. The, the 10th the, anniversary yes, on yeah. the 26th. Six, exactly. The 10th anniversary. And, and you know, you talk about 100 schools. You're going to surpass the goal that you set. That's amazing. <laughs> yes, our goal. Um, uh, was to re commemorate the 10th anniversary with rebuilding of 100 schools. Mm. And we will surpass that goal, but I can't share the number yet, yes. but it will be more, more than 100. And um, we are very um, excited because it's, it's a teamwork. It's, um, it's everyone on the ground coming together and, and uh, go, going towards the same goal. Every, all our uh, uh, corporate partners or our donors or our supporters, volunteers, everyone coming together towards the same goal. And I feel very honored um, because uh, the last 10 years, the, the amount of love which we have received is really, really beautiful. And, and you're talking about nine countries around the world, yes. right? Yes. So we, we have, right now, we have rebuilt 98 uh, schools in nine countries around the world helping 49,000 children um, and um, you know but the need is much greater the need is much much greater actually there has been an uh, increase of natural disasters the last decade 17 percent and the projections from Brooks Institute is 320 percent increase wow. in in the next 20 years that is amazing There's and I know that you have a lot of help a lot of support including Clinique that helps yes. you out to raise money to go out and build these schools yes quickly tell me about that so um, Clinique uh, is one of our smart initiatives. They created these beautiful products. One is a happy heart fragrance, and the other one is their famous chubby stick uh, and plumped up pink. And both of the uh, uh, products are gifts th which they give back, and they're great for uh, a, a, a great stuffing for stockings, Such or great work. and and they help to rebuild schools. Great uh, present for teacher because yes, they care they about are. education. Yes, they are. And it's a or, great thing to support. Or anyone who loves Clinique products. Of course, <laughs> Petra Nankova, Thank you so much. Congratulations. Thank really, you. such a wonderful work, and what a, an amazing story you've had. Thank, Thank you. you for being such an Thank inspiration you your, to us. Thank you for your love and care. Thank you for your <laughs> love and kindness and all the good things you're doing. Petra Nankova, yeah. Thank you very much.